Hello, my name is David Lepore. I'm the Director of Instruction at College and River Plantation Club. Welcome to this golf tip. You know, a lot of people talk about uh, getting out of the way of themselves or working on uh, their subconscious when they play golf. I've got a great suggestion on how to preoccupy your conscious mind so your subconscious can take care of business. In other words, I'm talking about the ritual. Now, a lot of people mistake the ritual for a pre-shot routine. Well, it's not. It's the specific sequence of movements after you do your routine, which include hitting the golf ball. In other words, pre-shot routine is everything leading up to hitting the golf ball. Ritual is actually a sequence of movements that include hitting the golf ball. It should have a minimum of four movements, maximum of eight, and hopefully be really rhythmic. So, for example, when I putt, I, I separate my hands like this on the grip, and when I'm ready, I squeeze my grip, and I'm going to consider that number one. Number two, I look at my target line. Number three, I look back to the ball. Number four, I take the putter back. And number five, I follow through. So you could say there's five movements in my ritual. So as I go through my routine and get ready to hit, the last thing I have to do is close the deal with an excellent ritual. So I'm going to take a practice swing, and a lot of people like to go ahead and do their ritual in their practice swing, and I'm okay with that. But as I move to the golf ball, and I'm set to go, I'm going to squeeze, and I'll be off and running. One, two, three, four, five. What a great way to create rhythm and real predictability when you're out on the golf course. One last thing. You can do a ritual from the first tee all the way to the 18th green. So not just on the putting green, but with your short game and full swing as well. So work on that, and I hope it helps.